<laughs> Welcome back. We have in the studio Scott Callies and Travis Alexander. Familiar faces. One of them. To the out. Yeah. Been here a few sure. times. A few Once times. Or twice. Yeah, Actually, you run the, run, run the camera for us uh-huh. a time or two. And you're here to talk about a wrestling, youth wrestling tournaments or is a, a teams. Is that right? Yeah, it's a, it's a club that we've, it's been going for quite a time, quite some time, and I'll let Travis kind of go more into it. He helped okay. get it started and everything as far as that goes, but we kind of want to get the word out there, what we have to offer for the kids, um, let people know that there is a program for the youth kids out Alternative there. programs. Yes. Okay, so yeah. youth, does that mean, because uh, Mountain Home has a junior high, they have a high school wrestling team. High school wrestling team. Uh, <clears throat> I coached a start. high school team for the past three years, and then last year, we decided to go ahead and start a youth program, which starts at age five and goes to 15. Wow. And, uh, <laughs> it's, it's like herding cats at times. Yeah. But uh, it, it's just a great program because. Uh, I can see some of those little five-year-olds just, oh, yeah. <laughs> just they, going they at it. it. Yeah. Enthusiasm, I'm sure they're, they're long on that. <clears throat> Yeah. Okay. For people that don't know what wrestling is, I mean, you say wrestling, they get, that, they get them in the, the mental picture of wrestling. You know the, the 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 ring and the whole thing, but tell us what wrestling is. Well, wrestling really is is the oldest sport in the world, mm-hmm. and uh, I mean the, some of the earliest depictions of athletics have been wrestling. And uh, of course, a lot of the Romans, you know, the first mm-hmm. Olympics, uh, wrestling was one mm-hmm. of the core sports in the very first Olympics. Yeah. Uh, but when we think about wrestling, yeah, a lot of people think about wrestling. That's kind of a bad word to us wrestlers. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, because, you know, that's just kind of the, I guess, the uh, daytime uh, TV show yeah. kind of yeah. deal. You get but, three, three uh, pats on right, the back. Yeah. Right, but, uh, <laughs> Instead of the one. But wrestling is, it's wrestling more is very organized different. Yeah, than people it's, think it's, it is. It's, it's very it's uh, regimented mm-hmm. as far as uh, size. Uh, mm-hmm. One of the things that's so neat about wrestling, it doesn't matter how old you are, what size you are your kid will have somebody they compete against their age and their weight. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, me, I was never a big guy, still still I'm not. Mm-hmm. And when I was in school, uh, one of the teachers came to me after school one day. He said, hey, meet me in the gym after school, a little bitty guy. And he says, uh, you ever wrestled before? And I said, no, just with my cousins. <laughs> you know, and uh, that's how I got started because, mm-hmm. you know, I wasn't big enough to play football or basketball, wasn't yeah. tall enough. Mm-hmm. And so it's a good outlet for kids in the wintertime. It's a winter sport. Mm-hmm that uh, allows them to compete at their mm-hmm. level mm-hmm. and, and uh, just a great program. Now, yeah. how long has, has there been wrestling here in our, because it's, I mean, it's a pretty unknown sport in most of Arkansas, but now in the Midwest and on the West Coast, wrestling's huge. I, I lived in Omaha, Nebraska growing up and wrestling mm-hmm. was, I mean, you had as many people in that gym at a wrestling meet as you had at a basketball game. Right. In Arkansas, it was sanctioned by the AAA, uh, which is Arkansas mm-hmm. Activity Association. Uh, I believe five years ago, this, okay. this will be coming six years, and uh, it was the 49th state in the <laughs> union uh, to actually add uh, wrestling at the high school level. But yes, our, uh, you know, so Arkansas is a little behind the power curve. Now, mm-hmm. Scott's from Oklahoma. They've had wrestling for years. I'm from Missouri. Mm-hmm. One of our other coaches is from Illinois. One of our other coaches is from uh, Alaska. And mm-hmm. so uh, we kind of come from, you know, well yes. rounded, you know, yeah. and just like yeah. you know, the state wrestling tournament in Missouri where I grew up, you know, I mean, it's a huge deal. It's a four day mm-hmm. event. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and if somebody mm-hmm. from your school is the state champion, oh, right. my mm-hmm. goodness, yeah. yes, serious. And stuff. so, uh, you know, so it's it is new in Arkansas, but you know, uh, I got involved in the program about four years ago, and then we've done the kind of limited youth for the past two or three years. Mm-hmm. Uh, I remember three years ago, we took, I think, four kids to the youth tournament, which is 15 and under. And uh, at that state tournament, at that level, there was about 200 wrestlers from all over the state. Uh, This past year, we uh, took uh, 22 kids Mm -hmm. uh, from here in Mountain Home Mm -hmm. or in the surrounding area, and there was almost 450 kids. You know, so it's really growing and it's really catching on. Uh, There's at least three colleges here in Arkansas that are now offering wrestling at the collegiate level. Mm-hmm. And I heard that Jonesboro ASU is getting ready to take it on. Are there and scholarships so, for it? Yes, yes. And so uh, uh, one of the big schools right now, or say one of the, one of the uh, schools that's really promoting wrestling here in Arkansas is Ochita and then also uh, CBC down in Conway. Mm-hmm. Uh, and so, yeah, it's really catching on in Arkansas. Well, let's talk about the youth wrestling. 
Uh, yeah, who that, do they that's, compete against? Is that intramural, or do you go to other communities? Other communities. We okay. do a lot of traveling. Uh, okay. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of early mornings, Saturday mornings. Mm -hmm. we, we get up and we pile to either Springdale, Rogers, Little mm -hmm. Rock, you know. But, uh, and it'll be kids from all over the state and some <coughs> even from other states. Mm -hmm. uh, this year we went to Bentonville. I think they had about 400 kids there. We had some from Oklahoma, from Missouri. Uh, and uh, they get out there and they break them down into age groups and weight size, and they just get out there and compete. So are, are you looking for uh, new participants in, in the program? All the time. All the time. Always. Okay. Yeah. I mean, now, the, 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 the key thing about the program of wrestling, I grew up with wrestling. I was in Oklahoma. It was offered <coughs> year-round from kindergarten on up, mm -hmm. and it taught you so much as a kid growing up. <coughs> Um, you know, to be, you know, the confidence that it builds in you, I know is, is, is a big thing. My son just started last year, started real late in the season. And to see the changes from when he started to now, it's unreal. He walks mm -hmm. on a mat, <clears throat> he doesn't care how big you are anymore. I mean, he's got all the confidence in the world when he goes for that person. And, and it's really helped to build him as a person. Mm -hmm. I know there's so many things that when I was younger that I use today that's helped me build yeah. who I am. Yeah. Well, what kind of fundraiser do you have going on? Yeah, we have got <clears throat> one thing. To keep in mind that we don't charge any anything for anybody to join the wrestling team. Okay. Um, we believe that every kid should have the opportunity. Um, you know, you do got to get you know your own shoes, stuff like that. But if you can't afford it, there's always a parent that's willing to step up, so there's no kid left behind. But by doing that, we also have to look at the community and different fundraisers and different things to raise money. Uh, one of the big thing we need right now is another mat. We we have one wrestling Another mat. Another right. mat. mat. Wrestling mat. Okay, wrestling mat. Okay. We have one large wrestling mat right now, and every kid has to share it. Mm -hmm. And it's a little tough when it comes uh, to practice. What's, what size are we talking about of a mat that well, you're looking to? <clears throat> the, the actual competition size is like a 30 by 30. Okay. Uh, but uh, most practice mats, you want them at least to be like a 36 by 36 okay. or even a 40 by 40. Mm -hmm. uh, and... Uh, you know they're not cheap. Uh, they're what, anywhere what? from about seven thousand to ten thousand dollars. Okay, so that's kind of <coughs> kind of what you're setting your financial yeah. goal at, right? Mm -hmm. And um, so one of the one of the things we're doing right now, and it'll be this Friday and this Saturday, is doing a yard sale um, right here in Mountain Home. It'll be located at eighteen oh eight Becker Street. Um, the we've got a variety of often They actually gave me a list of some of them that they've been getting in and. And there's some large items. We've got almost a brand new Lincoln arc welder. I oh. mean, almost okay. brand new. 220 arc welder, mm -hmm. nice unit, mm -hmm. uh, all the way down to small things, you know, clothing, things like that. There's somebody's uh, got a gas grill, um, even a walker. If somebody's needing a walker, I see one of them on there. But we've got a large variety of items that people have given us to sell okay. at this yard sale. Now, where's Becker at? <coughs> so that I don't, I mean, I can guess I could GPS it, but if you'll tell me where it's at, that'll help. Okay. It's uh, like you're headed down towards the high school, um, and we're going to have, as you're going down there, there are signs that are going to be laid okay. out okay. everywhere. So if someone just goes in the direction of the high school, they'll be able to find the yard sale. They, they will it. see the signs. See they the will signs. see the okay. signs. Okay. okay. It's kind of actually right behind the River, is it River Lakes Bowling Alley, or what's the <coughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. you, you turn there where the old Holiday Inn mm -hmm. used to be, and, and, and it's just right there on that okay. road. Okay, right. but, so people can okay. find it without any trouble. Sure. Now, we've got a uh, also a rocking chair, that a cedar rocking chair that we've been selling tickets to win a cedar rocking chair. We will have tickets being sold there, and I think we actually got a picture of the rocking chair, if Gil can put it on. Oh, yeah. Really nice rocking chair. That's and it's, it's big, beautiful. It looks okay. really nice. And we will have tickets uh, we're selling there, and after that we're actually going to do the drawing. And that so, uh, uh, yard sale is yeah. this, this Saturday? Friday and this Saturday. Friday and It'll so, be okay. Friday from 7 to 2 and Saturday from 7 to 12. Okay. All right. <laughs> what, about those, what about those people who come at 5 o'clock in the morning? Well, you're going to be waiting until 7. <laughs> <laughs> There's All right. many people That'll parked be out there. And we've yeah. also got, for kids that are interested, we do have uh, T-shirts. These are our tournament shirts. They're called King, oh, cool. of, the, uh, King of the Mountain T-shirts. And that's for okay. Okay. Mountain Home here. All right. Will we'll wrestling practice not start again until next fall then? No, we're Since actually going right now. Okay. Um, so it's a winter sport every... you're still practicing? Yes. Okay. 
We meet every Tuesday and every Thursday at 6 o'clock. And it is at the... Guy Guy Barry. Guy Barry. Okay. Guys, we're out of time. I appreciate you being here. Thank you. And if you'd like to have more information about uh, uh, what we talked about here, about uh, youth wrestling, there's more information at the end of this show, and you'll get a phone number and contact information. Thanks for for watching. We're out of time. We'll see you again Uh, next time. Next time. Next time. Next time. time. Not next (laughs) week.